Hey everyone, so this is a month or two overdue, the results for the AI game dev challenge on r slash the happy makers. Uh, I'm really sorry, I asked about a week after it was over if everyone could send me video clips because with my new setup it, I wasn't able to execute them as well and it was inconsistent. Sometimes my monitor's resolution, because it was very high resolution, would shrink everything down into a tiny box in the corner, if that makes any sense. So I asked people to send in video clips, and so I wanted to make sure to give a shout out to the people that did and show off their projects uh, because they're really cool. And I'm gonna link the whole thread down below uh, where you can give feedback on and check out everyone else's projects because there were quite a few and that's pretty awesome. Uh, as you might have noticed, I've gotten busier and busier, so these challenges might be retired or on hiatus for a bit. I'd like to find something that maybe has a bit quicker reaction that's easier for you guys to enjoy and for me to enjoy, so we'll see about that, but let's get right into it. Uh, first, we have Epic Knight 999 with his game Maze Runner. And now the AI challenge, this could be a story themed around AI. It could just be that you wrote uh, algorithms. In this case, uh, I looked through the Git repo a bit and there was like a star pathfinding handwritten um, or, you know, procedural generation, anything to kind of inspire you in an AI algorithmic uh, mindset, not really to be a hard restriction. So here's Maze Runner and then bonus points for also sending in uh, another game he made called Color Nations 3D. Uh, it's very cool. It looks like he managed to make it in Java and render it with no external libraries. So kudos to you. Uh, next we have user KD7UIY. Could 7 ue Sorry, I don't know how to pronounce that. But they made a C trading game where it it looks like there's an AI system to grow resources and procedurally generate terrain, and it's basically a game of economics. Next up, we have Random Humanity, who made a game called Write Only, and it looks like the theme of the game is kind of around AI that um, believe or they <laughs> worship this like floppy disk, and I, I think you're fighting against those um, AI robots. And then of course you can also see that there's uh, enemy AI within the game. Finally, we have Saza Zezer, <laughs> um, who has the game, I don't think it had a name per se, but it was a really cool system where if the player um, ran into an AI, they would chase after the player, but then the AI themselves have a whole system where they get fatigued or have to go to the bathroom or get hungry, so they go off and do their own thing. So I thought that was really cool as well. Um, yeah, I just want to thank you guys so much. Uh, there's, once again, I always say this, there's so much talent in this community, and I hope you guys do uh, check out their stuff, give feedback on code projects, and yeah, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully we'll have different fun types of challenges in the future. Uh, have a happy day wherever you are. I'll see you guys soon. Bye!